Hi, my name is Isabel Hotop. Um, I am from Perryville, Missouri. Um, I graduated from St. Vincent High School and I play softball here at Mount Fun University. Okay, so my major is speech language pathology and I would love to be um, a speech language pathologist and um, working with kids, I guess. So I'm not sure if I want to do um, something with swallowing, something um, in a school or a hospital, but just something working with kids would be awesome. Alright, so the reason I came to Fafon is um, one, they had my majors that I was really interested in. Um, two, they had a great softball program and I knew the coach and he was awesome, so I really wanted to come here. And then three, I'm Catholic and they had a really cool um, just, you know, Catholic community, so that was awesome. Um, I really liked the small class sizes. That was um, a big appeal to me since I'm from a small town. Um, and then it was like the perfect distance from my hometown. It was about an hour and a half. So, you know, too, not too far, not too close, so. My favorite thing about Fon Fon is um, the really tight-knit community. Everybody really knows each other. Um, so for me, like being from a small town, it was really cool to be in a community that everybody knows each other and it's really tight-knit. Um, and it's also super awesome with the contrast of having the huge city of St. Louis because you like have your small town, but then you have the whole city of St. Louis to explore too. So I really liked that. So um, with our coach retiring, it's definitely very different having a new coach. Um, so I actually played with our coach my freshman year. Um, and so it's a different dynamic for sure um, because obviously she's going to coach in way different ways than our coach did before. Um, but as someone who's played for the team, she knows how we work and how hard we work. Um, so she really knows how to, far to push us. And so that's a really nice part about having her here. Okay, so my perfect pizza, I'm actually gluten-free and can't eat dairy, so I would go to um, Pi, which is like right down on the loop, and they have gluten-free crust, and they have vegan cheese, and I forget what I always get there, but it has like chicken and um, barbecue sauce on it, and it's so good. I could switch places with somebody for a day, it would be Robert Irvine because he's an awesome chef and he's really good at like working with people, so I would switch places with him. If I had a superpower, it would be flying because I'm really scared of heights, but I'm not so much scared of the heights as I am just like falling, so if I could fly, I think I would not be scared of that and I could just go wherever I wanted. So. So my role models in my life are probably my parents. Um, my dad's super hardworking. He gives great advice. Like I can come to him with anything. He always makes time for me. Um, so that's just three things that I really admire about him. And then my mom's really awesome. She's super loving, but at the same time, like if you're gonna mess up, like she tells you, like she helps you out. She doesn't um, just ignore the problem. So and I really admire that about her. Three people that I would have dinner with um, are Robert Irvine because he's super awesome and cool and I'd love to meet him. Um, my other one is Jesus because um, I'm Catholic and I feel like that's a really big important thing and I'd love to meet Jesus obviously. Um, and the third one is Shakespeare because I'm really not obsessed with Shakespeare. I think it's I think Shakespeare is really cool and plus no one actually like knows um, who he actually was. So if I met him I would know. So if I could go anywhere in the world, I would love to go to Rome. Um, my uncle lived in Rome after college, so he was my godfather, and he always sent me pictures over from there. And um, he would just send me pictures, hey, here's my backyard, and just be an awesome picture of just ruins. Um, and so I think that would be super neat to go over there. Plus, there's just a ton of history over there um, that I'd love to go see that. So, yeah. So some hidden talents I have, number one, um, I'm a sewer. I like to sew a lot of things. So uh, my senior year, I made my homecoming dress and my prom dress. Um, they were both like old dresses that I took. They were, they were ugly. And I uh, cut them apart and put them back together. My uh, prom dress is actually two dresses that I put together. Um, and they both came out really, really awesome. So spent like maybe $50 total on both my dresses. So it was a nice, nice cheap option. It was a lot of fun too. 
Um, and then my other hidden talent um, was in high school, I was a beekeeper, so I had my own hive um, outside my house, and um, yeah, I would go out and check on them every once in a while, so I actually, I hate animals, but I love bees, so that's kind of ironic, but yeah. <laughs>